So I've already um, done my base. You can check out the video of the highlighting contouring like Kim Kardashian video um, where I show you exactly how I created this look um, of base. So I'm just going to use a brow kit just to apply a little bit of wax to the hairs and that way it just kind of helps to pat down any stray hairs that you may have. And a lot of celebrities nowadays are doing that fuller brow look. So you can cheat if you don't have that full brow. I don't have a problem in that area so it's kind of easy but at the same time I wish my eyebrows weren't as full because they just take up a lot of focus from my face because they're so dark but then I can't complain because well I can complain actually because it takes me <laughs> it takes me like every 10 days I'd have to thread my eyebrows take your bare canvas or any light matte shade and just apply it they're very pigmented so I'm going straight ahead and applying bare canvas all over you want to apply it to the entire lid so that you get most of it highlighted okay so can you see how it's very very highlighted We want to do next is use espresso which is this very dark brown shade I'm using again my angled brow brush and I love using this for very definite eyeshadow so I want to apply a cut crease to the eyes what you want to do is just angle the brow brush and just start to etch your crease line into the eye And you don't want to go too far down so just try and keep it as close to the natural crease but not on the crease just above it and bring it bring it in slightly due to a small fault with my camera I didn't get to capture the next step but basically just add a little bit more product to the outer corners and just fill it out and just start to softly blend the product so the eyeshadow is basically quite dense to the outer corners and buffs out as you'll see in the next step. I'm applying my liquid liner, I've already applied it on this side, this is my Extreme Art liquid liner pen. Now this is like a must product, I love it so much um, because I'll explain in another video why I love this but so, so much. <laughs> basically a pen which is also a liquid liner so you don't have the cross contamination if you're using on other clients of dipping in double dipping so and it's very precise it can create the most perfect line it's so fine and um, it's very easy to to use and handle because you don't have to worry about your brush or gel liner drying up while you're working it just continually flows to the tip so it's it's one of my most favorite products by far so I'm just gonna apply my I'm working on this mascara for ages just trying to perfect it it's out the makeup mascara and um, it's really good for separating your lashes giving them volume thickness and so we're nearly there so it should be launching soon can you see that how it just completely dramatizes your lashes and that's what we want we want to keep a lot of drama on the lashes the liquid liner as well so i'll just do the other eye I don't know whether to put it on the bottom lashes. Quite like the effect of just the top lashes having mascara. Hmm. Shall we put some on the bottom? What do you guys think? Let's go for it then. <laughs> the good thing is with this brush, it's got this smaller 
bristles at the bottom and longer bristles at the top, so ideal for bottom lashes. So it's basically done. I don't want to put actually any blusher on my cheeks because they're already very well contoured. I'm just going to be applying this Motives Naked Lipstick and uh, that should be the finished look. This one is naked, I just want a very neutral shade. My lips are a little dry, but this is a really nice colour if you want something quite natural. And there you go, a very easy, quick makeup. If you're like on the go and you want to look glamorous, you can check out how I did the contouring and foundation for this video. Um, it's obviously not included, it's on another video. So if you liked it, then have a, have a look. Uh, make sure you subscribe, make sure you like the video and I'll be making another one very, very soon. I'm actually gonna make one for my Kardashian collection which was at Dorothy Perkins last week and I'm going to show you everything that I bought. So I'll see you in the next video.